Hey, yo, what is up, guys? Your boy Ed from Lacey Beach. You already know I got the undefeated right here yet again. Peter Assad. He's going to be playing a different deck every week kind of thing. You know, Peter topped with what? Uh, Life Twin, Rune Express. Uh, how do you play it with you to, uh, for you today? Um, it's actually very, it's a fairly good deck. It's not explosive, very controlly, and uh, yeah, it's, a good deck. it's not really my play style, to be honest whoosh, with you. Whoosh, but, um, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Awesome. Well, let's get into the deck. All right, so for Live Twins, the Live Twins, we have the three Blue Twin, three Lilla, three K two Kiss a Kill Red, and then one of the Frost. Um, it's pretty standard lineup for life in the package. Uh, yeah. No need to change this. Um, now for the sprites, I click three blue, two jet, two red and a carrot. I know a lot of people play the one jet based on like the Joshua Smith build. I like two because I like follow up. I like having more in the grind. So yeah. Cool. Um, and the last monster I played was just three ash. Um, I like ash universally good card. Um, so this format is very undefined. We don't really know like what's good i mean every local i play like That's different, different decks yeah. every tournament and I, I play a different deck as well so like yeah ash just need ash <laughs> Um, then Runic package, we play the two fountain, and we play the three curses, the three tip, three destruction, three flashing fire, three slumber, one, I always forget this one, the spelling, um, <laughs> I like this count, uh, on Runic spells, um, pretty much maxing out all the good ones and then one extra one with the dispelling, so, yep. Cool. Then I play the one live twin spell card, um, I just, it's just another, it's a Rota, but because draws in the format, you don't want to play too much of this. Um, usually you just get the blue twin, or if you got Imperm, you get the, the red twin extenders with the frost. Um, the last thing is the sprite, just two starter, one smasher. Again, I have the starter because I think the sprite engine is very strong to get you going, you always want to get that going. Um, and then I play staple card, or just two towers. Kobai the Grave. Kobai is there to have like a Dragoons and things like that, just like a hard time adding those like boss monsters, so I played that. How many cards in the main deck? 41. 41, not bad. Yep. That's that. Uh, I can tell you here. Then we look at the extra deck. We'll play the two Huggins and the one Jerry. Jerry never came up. He's there to loop back Fountain, but uh, yeah. I kind of want third third Huggin, obviously. But yeah. Um, then for the links, we play the one Sprint. Live Twins, we three red, three blue. Um, I did use both of them quite a bit, so I know some people play like 2 1, but I prefer to max 2 2. Yeah. Uh, Mascarena, this card's insane because it goes into another card I'm about to go into. Uh, Mudcracker, never made it. Main card I go into with Mascarena, Griffin. It's cards are actually insane against Brain Dead. So I played Brain Dead round four. Um, I made this, pointing it to the Red Twin. Um, and I really couldn't play because there's no links, they play no links, and they have no link arrows towards him, so he's effectively normal Luger. <laughs> Um, you play the big life twin, Trouble Sunny, the Abomination. This card's really powerful. Um, on my last round, Striker with this card. Um, just all the pops are just good. And it can be sure my card for me to last round. It's nice. Uh, last thing is just Gigantic Sprite and uh, Anakin Cat. Um, the only thing I would change, honestly, here is possibly cut this for another one of this. Okay. I just really like this card as follow up. And honestly, but not a third Hugan? Maybe cut this too as well for the third game. So, okay. But that's it. So that's for the main deck. Extra. Side is. Let me go through the one of those I played. I played one Regeki. I actually saw it today against Blunder. It didn't, didn't actually do me any good. <laughs> uh, Chaos Hunter. Um, this card actually won me a Castira matchup because I got Shifter. So the shifter combo effectively is when you get shifter, um, you can actually turbo this out with mannequin cat. So if you make mannequin cat, you summon the shifter to their field, and then you can summon this from your deck, and then now you put them in a, a very bad position because they have a body on the board, so you can't just special like Fenrir or Unicorn, as well as they, uh, none of your cards are no longer getting banished. So like, uh, um, after this touches down, the rest of your engine just goes to grave because your opponent cannot banish your cards. It's really good. Uh, or at least that's how I got ruled today, so. <laughs> 
Uh, one yeah. volcanic scatter shot. This is just for time. It never came up. And then um, we play the two carry Kura, three Magnum, one Druis. Um, this is for branded um, and striker. Really good that matchup too. Pass eight three evenly, and then three Cosmo just to win. Oof. But yeah, that's it. Any final words on today's tournament? Um, it was pretty good. I mean, um, just so a very grindy deck. Um, all the matches were. You know, interactive. I will say this deck is a very interactive deck. Um, but I don't see myself playing this in the future, to be honest, because it's not explosive. But it is very good if you're a control player. If you like control, play this deck. He said he's done with this deck. Now he's going to play another one. <laughs> all right. Good job, Peter. All right. Have a good one. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. Don't forget to check out Dank Rituals. Their link will be down in the description. Also, you guys should definitely join my Facebook group. I have a lot of really cool updates and a lot of uh, really good information that you guys might want to keep up with about giveaways and whatnot on there. Uh, also, please, guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I would like for you guys to turn on that bell notification as well. I would like to grow my percentage of subbed and not subbed from 20% higher. Uh, I, would, I would really appreciate that. And don't forget to like, comment, share. You already know, guys. Appreciate you all very much, and I'll see you on the next video. Yeah.